Game 5, Eastern Conference Semifinals. The Celtics find themselves on a postseason deadlock at two games apiece. It is a critical turning point, and they know the time is now as they face a pivotal Game 5 against the Bucks. Round 2 of the NBA Playoffs continue. Coming right up. Welcome to the NBA Playoffs here on 2K Sports. It's Game 5. I'm Kevin Harlan with Greg Anthony, Hall of Famer Doris Burke, and another Hall of Famer, David Aldridge, from the sidelines. Hey, Dave. Thank you, Kevin. We all know that Giannis Adentacumpo is the Greek freak, but he doesn't want to limit himself to any country. He said that family members have told me I can't be the face of the league because I'm not American. But man, if I can't do it being me, then I don't want to be the face of the league. I know where I came from, what me and my family have been through, and it's something I take pride in. Kevin? Well said, David. Wonderful story. Thank you. You look at the Bucks. They've held their own so far, Greg, in this series, and if they can pull it off, what a win that would be for them tonight. And it will put them in the driver's seat, Kevin. One win from the conference finals. Game fives on the road are never easy to win, though. For them to do it, they're going to have to grind this one out. That's why game fives are so fun. Here are the starters for Milwaukee. The big men on the floor, Giannis and Lopez. Holiday out there with Matthews. And it's Allen in at the three spot. And for the Celtics. Smart in the backcourt with Brown to his side. Jason Tatum is out there with Williams. And it's Horford in at the center. Now here's Tatum. Horford trying to free himself up. Tatum's shot is off. On the wing, Yacht. He's guarded by Williams. And stolen by Tatum. And now with the fast break, Smart with the ball. That doesn't go, and he's 0 of 1 from the field. Outside, Holiday. Now, Matthews. Green by Giannis. Six to shoot. Matthews passes to Giannis. An easy two points on the layup. And how about the effort? You did think a little contact would prevent Giannis from scoring, did you? Brown outside. And there's the foul. It goes on Wesley Matthews. That's his first foul. Here in the first, a little over a minute played so far. Outside Tatum from deep. A shot, no good. And Milwaukee the other way now. They look to start a new streak after losing on Monday. Really a, a disappointing effort. That, that game could have and should have been closer than it was. Listen, I don't fault the effort. That was there all night. It was the quality of play that was lacking. There was not a ton of cohesion. They've got to figure it out. That's how you share the rock. He does this time and time again. Allen kicks to Giannis. And the slam dunk by Antetokounmpo. And that move has become second nature for Giannis. Once he establishes position, game over. Smart against Holiday. Passes to Tatum. Williams sets a screen for Tatum. The kick out to Williams. Hands it from downtown. Williams has got five. Well, this is the aspect of Tatum's game that is most improving. The ability to manipulate defenses and find an open teammate. Now here is Holiday. Back to Giannis. Outside Holiday, five to shoot. Milwaukee needs to get off a shot here. A three-pointer off the mark. Boston trailing. Outside, smart. Brown outside. And that won't go, missing the go-ahead bucket. The Bucs have gone three of four from the field to start out the game. Matthews against Brown. And they double up out of DeCumbo. Outside Matthews. 
over Horford. And it's sent back by Horford. Well, this is how Al Horford gets it done as a rim protector. His anticipation and his positioning are exceptional. And he's not going to miss that sort of an opportunity from deep. Holiday finds Giannis. Giannis dunks it down. Oh, fellas, that was a vicious two-hand monster slam. Guys, I don't think there was anyone who could have stopped him on that one. Smart passes to Horford and finished off by Horford. And it's the way Horford finishes, beating everyone to the cup, dropping the hammer. Giannis, a screen on Smart. Here's Holiday, a terrific shot on the turnaround. Uh, there's no quitting this guy. He just gives you great effort, and he continues to give you great production. Smart dishes to Tatum. He feeds it to Horford. Pass to Smart. Over Holiday. Smart misses. And it's on to Takumbo with the ball. He'll bring it up for the Bucks. Matthews, no good. Smart deciding where to go with it. Kicks it to Tatum. The 10-footer. That one a little long. Milwaukee's gone 0 of 2 from deep here. Outside Holiday. Giannis. And the foul on Marcus Smart. That's his first foul. Outside Holiday. Giannis outside. Lock at six. To the middle and stolen by Horford and he was camped in just the right spot to swipe that pass away down low smart misses the three for Milwaukee they've gone five of eight from the field shooting over 62 percent that gives them the lead Allen's got his second basket of the night and the passing skills of Giannis continue to improve his floor awareness has grown through the years now here's smart He's still scoreless so far in this one. Brown, good. And guys getting into a nice groove here, starting to feel it. And this is partly what the game has become, right? A matter of dueling three-point opportunities. Down low. And Matthews gets it to go in on the assist by Giannis. Andre DeCumbo's got three assists now in this one. Now here's Smart. Brown outside. Rebound Giannis into the Kumbo. Boy, this guy is a good finisher, so he misses a chippy. That's tough to take. And Holiday kicks to Allen. Williams against Holiday. Five on the clock. Let's it go with the three. And Boston with the rebound. Outside Tatum. Pass to Smart. To the paint. Here's Horford. And finished off by Horford. Oh, don't you love how unselfish Marcus Smart is? Sees the open man, whips the pass over in just the right amount of space. And Milwaukee time out, time out. calls their first time out of the game. And sometimes from the outside, not always clear what led a coach to call for a timeout. And as you know, it's what comes after that gives you some sense of what has changed.
Austin making some changes. Daniel Tice is checked in for Williams. Derek White comes in for Tatum. And it's Pritchard in for Smart. And then for Milwaukee. Portis, he's checked in for Lopez. Pat Connaughton comes in for Allen. And it's Hill in for Matthews. Hill against White. Hill looking it over. Just five on the clock. Portis sets the pick for Hill. Knocks down the three ball. And the Bucks lead by three. Yeah, this guy takes a ton of three pointers. George Hill is a knockdown shooter from deep. Outside, White. No good on that one. Some solid defense from Antetokounmpo. With the drive. Here's Connaughton, guarded by Horford. The pass to Antetokounmpo. Bucks passing it around. Here's Connaughton. It's stolen by Brown. Passes it to Tice. He dishes it to Horford. Back to Tice. And the rejection by Antetokounmpo. And if Giannis is anywhere close to you, don't shoot it. His length covers a ton of ground. And boy, is he fast. And Boston with the rebound. And they've come out with a take-no-prisoners approach on the glass here tonight, guys. Here's Pritchard. He's guarded by Hill. Outside, Horford. Brown outside. Shoots from the high post. Milwaukee with the rebound. Ande DeCumbo has got his seventh rebound here tonight. Outside, Holiday. White with the defensive effort. Not a lot falling for him in this quarter. He's got to stay aggressive, try to break through. See if you can get an easy opportunity. Tice with a screen on Hill. He hits Brown with the drive. Uh, don't you love how Brown just barrels into the teeth of the defense? This is a shifty forward who knows how to get to the rack. Connaughton, and it's blocked by Brown. And he drops in the way up off the glass. Brown's got 10. And a breakdown here, guys. The hustle stats for the Celtics. Great hustle defensively through the first half. Contesting everything and racking up the block shots. And you know, the other thing they've done really well tonight is stay active defensively. Lots of steals, and that's making a huge difference. Yeah, those are starting to add up, guys. Of their last five baskets, three have been triples.
146 left in the first. Here's Pritchard. Still looking for his first bucket in this one. Tice trying to break free. A shot by Pritchard, no good. They've been beating them to a lot of those loose balls and rebounds here to start. Portis sets the pick for Hill. And the layup is good. Hill's got five points so far. Well, that's strength and savvy from the veteran George Hill, despite the defense's best ever. He does a great job finishing. Now, here's Brown. Guarded close. It's Solenbad. It's a Kumbo. Pass to Connaughton. There's 53 seconds left in the first quarter. Yes, that goes in. Oh, this is the kind of start they were hoping for. Celtics trail by six. Pass to Tice. He kicks it to Horford. Outside, White. Shot clock at six. Here's Horford. White setting the pick for Horford. And the rejection by Adetokounmpo. Here's Connaughton. He's covered by Brown. And there's the pass to Hill. Giannis dishes to Hill. Back to Giannis. Shot from 12. And that's the final possession with the nice defense right there. And so it's Milwaukee with their lead standing at six points here at the end of the quarter. A look at the field goal percentage numbers tells the story of what tough defense they're playing today. Don't go anywhere. We'll be right back. And as we know, the great ones make those around them better. That's certainly the case with Giannis Antetokounmpo. I'm a lot more comfortable. Uh, it's because my teammates trust me. My team trusts me to make the right play. And, you know, lately, late uh, in the game, I uh, just try to make the right play. That can be a pass. Uh, that can be a shot. But that's my mindset down the stretch. Hmm, not predetermined. He's reading the defense and then responding accordingly. Well, it, it starts with getting downhill. The, the defense has to build a wall to keep him away from the rim. And you are back with us live as we bring you continuing coverage of the Eastern Conference semifinals. And guys, let's get your take on the scoring breakdown for the Bucks. They pounded the ball inside in the first half, forcing the D to collapse, and that frees up the shooters going forward. I think the other thing they've had going for them is their passing. Plenty of their baskets have come off assists. On the court for the Bucks, Allen is out there with Portis. Then there's Hill, then it's Brooke Lopez, and it's Connaughton in at the two. Well, that's a blown defensive coverage, but it doesn't matter. He cannot answer the bell. And White kicks to Tatum. Gets that one to drop. First one of the game after four straight misses. Well, Jason Tatum has worked hard to fill out his frame. It's not going to bother him that you're bringing a level of physicality. Now, here's Lopez. Nothing yet on the scoreboard for him. Allen finds Portis. Over Tice. And Tatum pulls it down. And here's Tatum. He'll bring it up for the Boston Celtics. They haven't allowed any points in the second quarter. And guys, they continue to put a lot of pressure on the interior defenders with their work down low. Here's Allen following the basket by Derek White. Allen, a screen on Tice. Portis, the pass to Connaughton. Over Tice. And that one's good from Connaughton. Connaughton's got seven points. Celtics trail by four. And here's White. 
quarter two and just under two and a half minutes gone by. And White slams it in. I'll bet even they didn't think the pick would work that well. No, no, no. And they get the major league dunk out of it, too. And my question is, where was the help? Someone rotate over and challenge. And so it's Milwaukee now after the basket by Boston. And it's sent back by White. And a fast break now for the Celtics. Can't tie it up as that one misses. Milwaukee's gone three of six tonight when they've let it fly from downtown. Lopez a screen on White. Here's Connaughton. He dents the rim with a two-handed slam. Wow. Oh, and he went for the two-hander on the slam using some muscle. Some urgency from him there. Sure. Tatum drives in. Oh, and the jam by Tatum. That's right. This guy is capable of some amazing finishes. Jason Tatum, my goodness. And great camera work showing up on the AT&T 5G Slam Cam. To the inside and stolen by Tatum. And up the court come the Celtics on the break. And White slams it in. It almost feels like two buckets coming off the steal like it did. Hill passes to Connaughton. Portis the screen inside takes the assist and lays it in pick out the pass nicely well they're trying to establish their attack down in the paint and make no mistake these help their overall confidence smart against hill now here's smart not a lot of room his fourth shot his fourth miss still looking for his touch tonight Here's Connaughton, defended by Tice. Passes it to Ports. Over White. And that one hits back iron. The Celtics have gone 5 of 8 from the floor here in the second quarter. Over 60% shooting. Smart dishes to Tatum. He can't get it to go. So Milwaukee will take it the other way. Smart against Hill. To the paint. Here's Portis. It's rebounded by Tice. Tice has got four rebounds now tonight. Smart against Lopez. Pass to Williams. Over Hill. Again, the miss by the Celtics. The Bucs have gone just 33% from the field in what's been a cold second quarter for them. Just three of nine. Pass to Portis. Shoots over White. And again, the Bucks miss. Boy, what a nightmare quarter for this guy. He's playing right into the hands of the defense at this point. Tice sets a screen for White. Right wing lets the free fly. Again, the miss by the Celtics. Milwaukee in the lead. Portis the screen. Here's Connaughton, and it's blocked. Always engaged on the defensive end. Daniel Tice with the excellent rejection. And it's White missing. Milwaukee's gone three of six tonight when they've let it fly from downtown. Lopez a screen on White. Allen in the post. White covering. Lopez inside. He's against Williams. Just three to shoot. Shoots the three. Lopez, no luck. Boston's gone 0-2 from deep here in the second. Back to Tatum. They could use a bucket. He takes it up and lays it in. Tatum's got it all tied up now for the Celtics. And, and he has really come to life here after a slow start in that first quarter.
Some changes for Boston. Al Horford, he's checked in for Daniel Tice. Jalen Brown comes in for White, and it's Pritchard in for Marcus Smart. The Bucks also changing it up. Antetokounmpo's checked in for Lopez. Matthews comes in for Pat Connaughton, and it's Drew Holiday in for George Hill. to Takumbo finds Allen and the rejection by Tatum Brown feeling it out a bit out to the right wing Pritchard passes to Williams Holiday against Tatum four on the shot clock over Holiday Tatum no good you know, he made an easy shot so much harder. And it really cost him the bucket, guys. There's the lob at Takumbo. And the slam dunk by Hunter Takumbo. And one of the most athletic players in the league. Giannis makes those alley-oop jams look easy. Outside Tatum. That shot off. Excellent D there from Allen. Here's Hunter Takumbo. Misses from short range. And here's Brown. He'll bring it up for the Boston Celtics. Trailing by two. And the pass to Pritchard. Williams a screen on Holiday. Here's Pritchard. Guarded by Holiday. The three from Tatum. The rebound by Holiday. Milwaukee has gone three of seven tonight from three-point territory. Back to Giannis. And they double up Giannis. Holiday against Brown. The shot by Holiday, no good. Tatum passes to Pritchard. Williams, a screen on Holiday. Stolen by Holiday. Giannis outside. Back to Holiday. This is a two out of the Kumbo. The kick out to Holiday. Six on the shot clock. Out of the Kumbo setting the pick for Holiday. And the Bucks miss again. Boy, a forgettable night for him, but thankfully his teammates have played well overall. Back to Brown. Tries the spin move. Celtics passing it around. Horford with a screen on Matthews. Here's Pritchard. No good. That would have tied it. Milwaukee's gone 0-2 from deep here in the second. And Adedekumbo with the basket on the assist by Allen. Adedekumbo's got 10 points. Celtics trail by four. Here's Pritchard. He's gotten some minutes, but nothing on the board yet. Here's Horford. And he can't stop this drought. Another miss. Down low, here's Allen. This is Giannis. Score the basket. It's number six for him this game. Six for nine, 67% shooting. And they're passing the ball very crisply here. Pritchard passes to Horford. Pass to Pritchard. Horford with a screen on Holland. Takes it inside, and that'll be two free throws coming up. Officials on the call with the foul. The Celtics shooting their first free throws tonight. The first trip to the stripe in this one. Shooting two. And the first one drops.
and he makes both free throws. An efficient night from the line. This is a guy who puts in the work and it pays dividends. Takes it from 10 and another basket for Milwaukee. They are just killing them on the interior. Williams a screen on Holiday. Pritchard passes to Tatum. Here's Pritchard. Driving in. Lays it up off the glass. Well, you like how aggressive he is making a play at the rim against Glenn. You have got to believe that you can score against size on the interior. How about the aggressive, assertive move there? No good that time. Great D that time from Tatum. Celtics trail by four. Pass to Pritchard. Forty-four seconds left to play here in the second quarter. Going inside. It's rebounded by Portis. Portis has got his seventh rebound of the game with that last one. Allen kicks to Holiday. And Holiday throws it down. And, and Holiday's nimbleness gets him to the hoop on that one. His athletic ability is off the charts. To the inside. Here's Williams. They get it back. Outside Tatum from past the arc. And it's good. Assisting on the play was Williams. Tatum's got nine points. That pass had to be thrown not only in the right spot, but at the right time. Outside, out of the Kumbo. And that one released in time, but no good. Well, we love Al Horford because he's an effective two-way player. His attention to detail on the defensive end paying off. And that's it for the first half of action. What's been a very close game here. Milwaukee on top. They lead by three. And now let's catch up with David Aldridge, who's standing by from the sideline. All right, Dave. Thanks very much, Mike. Stout effort defensively in the first half. What did you do to limit them? I just think our activity on the ball, we got to try and keep it in front of us. Our bigs did a good job, I think, being big in the paint, making things tough there. We got to finish it with the board. Yep, rebounds and possessions, Coach. Thanks. Back to you guys. Thank you, David. And we'll be back for the third quarter of action following halftime. Greetings, one and all. The postseason drama we love and no disappointment here as it's a close game so far for the Milwaukee Bucks. We have to love the second unit. I mean, the effort they display, they're doing much more than giving the starters a break. We're seeing real intensity from them, particularly on the offensive end. Looking at how the Celtics are doing in this series. It's going to be a three-game series here on out. Still, you have to like their chances as they'll have the home court advantage. Yeah, I do, and I think they'll get it done. But even if they fall behind 3-2 in the series, you can't count these guys out, Chad. Yeah, true. I feel like T-I-S-A-S. And no, that's not a tasty appetizer, Kenny. It's an acronym for this is still any one series. Well, I can change the next two games, guys. But really, I think it can go seven. And with our appetizer round all <laughs> gobbled up, <laughs> that's going to do it for us. We'll send you back now for the start of the second half. Hey, hey Kenny, pass me those chips. And we're back for more exciting action from the Eastern Conference semifinals. You look at Antetokounmpo, and this game has been everywhere. Yeah, he's been nothing short of a wall at the rim so far in this one, single-handedly providing great rim protection. If he is in the area, he's going to challenge your shot. He's going to block it, alter it. He's going to have an impact. So glad to have you with us here as we bring you more action from courtside at game five. Outside, the wings are Brown and Tatum. Williams is out there with Horford, and it's smart and at the point guard position. That's the Boston Five. 
and capable of making these in his sleep. Holiday has tremendous confidence and touch on that mid-range. Now here's Smart. No points in the game yet for him. Horford no luck. Something that's kept this game close is the fact that the rebound stats for both teams are almost identical. Everyone knows the catch-and-shoot game of Wes Matthews is lethal. Gives the defense no time to react. And here's Smart following the three from Wesley Matthews. Horford with the screen on Holiday. There's the pass to Tatum. Driving to the basket. The rebound by the Bucks. Lopez has got four rebounds in this game. Allen against Tatum. Shot from 12. The rebound by the Celtics. Smart goes in. Here's Horford. And a dunk by Horford. Well, Al Horford does not mind sending a message now and then. How about that easy flush? Outside, out of the Kumbo. Back to Holiday. It's Matthews on the wing. And it's off from three-point range. And here's Brown. He'll bring it up for the Celtics. Six-point game. Tatum's shot is off. I'll tell you, this guy is doing absolutely everything he can to get himself going, but the team is struggling because he's struggling. Giannis is screen on smart. Here's Holiday. That shot, no good. Nice D from Williams. This shot's just, it's not there right now with his team leading. Perhaps, you know, let's focus on some other areas of the game. On the Dekumbo against Tatum. Pass to Williams. Over Allen. Williams shot is off. Bucks leading by six. Giannis passes to Holiday. Now, Matthews. Pass to Antetokounmpo. Over Williams. And again, the Bucks miss. The Celtics have gone only 1-5 from the field since halftime. Very slow start offensively. Tatum wide open. He fires one. Good, and Smart gets the assist. Smart's got his seventh assist of the game with that last one. Allen against Tatum. Allen left side. Loads it up for Giannis. Throws down the alley-oop slam. Oh, phenomenal alley-oop slam there. They are taking advantage of a team that looks lost out there. Holiday against Smart. Good D by Holiday. Milwaukee has gone one of two from beyond the arc since coming out of the break. Offensive rebound. And to Kumbo. Makes it off the glass. Giannis has got 16 points. And with his length and explosiveness, it's never a surprise to see Giannis get points on the offensive glass. Great nose for the ball. Now here's Tatum. 12 points for him. And the layup's good off the glass. Tatum's got five points now this quarter. Coming off a big game, his confidence couldn't be higher, and Coach knows it. Well, the best players, to me, deliver night after night after night. So as long as he's hot, keep riding it. Giannis against Williams, and here's Matthews, the three, and Boston with the rebound. Williams has got rebound number seven for him tonight. Smart finds Williams. Outside, Tatum takes the three. And again, Boston with the triple. Challenging this D with the three ball. That's his second from distance this half. And he also hit one in the first half, too. Timeout, timeout. timeout called the Bucks. And as the coaches go to the clipboard to outline their strategy during the timeout, the players getting a chance to rehydrate with some Gatorade. That's key to staying fresh all the way to the final whistle. And, Kevin, it really is. And every one of these players knows it. They're all making sure to stay hydrated. It's impossible to play your A game if you're not getting enough to drink, especially uh, towards the end of games when the physical toll of a long contest really starts to add up.
Derek White checked in for Williams. Milwaukee also making some changes. Pat Connaughton comes in for Allen. And George Hills subbed in for Drew Holiday. After the Kumbo finds Hill. Outside Matthews. Pass to Giannis. Just five to shoot. And down it goes, jamming that one home. Well, that leadership from Lopez wanting to get his guys involved with his passing ability. Outside Horford. It's White on the wing. He's covered by Matthews. Here's Tatum. No good on that one. Now the Bucks take it the other way. Lopez sets a screen for Matthews. To the middle. Lopez kicks to Connaughton. Shoots over Brown and misses it off the right side of the rim. Celtics trail by four. Now the pass to Tatum. Horford with a screen on Giannis. Tatum against Giannis. Can't connect from 14 feet out. And so Giannis will bring it up for the Milwaukee Bucks. Passes it to Lopez. Hill against Smart. Pass to Antetokounmpo. And Tatum pulls it down. Boston's gone 6 of 12 from outside. A very nice 50% mark. Shooting the three ball well. Go into the rack with energy. And the D afraid to cut him off. Yeah, got to chalk that one up to some shaky defender. Yeah, and give him credit for taking advantage. In a close game, those are the types of plays that can swing things in your direction. Here's Connaughton. 11 points in the game. Pass to Anadokounmpo. Connington kicks to Lopez. And the three ball is good. Lopez has got himself going there. His first points of the game on the deep ball. Inside. Yep, it goes in. And the Milwaukee lead is cut down to just three in the basket from Brown. Well, how about Jalen Brown showing us his touchdown low? Skilled at getting high percentage shots in the paint. The drive by Hill. The shot. No good. Boy, that's the kind of look this offense is designed to create. That's just a tough miss. Smart against Matthews. Here's Brown. Rebound by Brooke Lopez. Lopez has got rebound number five here tonight. Matthews passes to Andacumbo. Lopez outside. The pass to Connaughton. Launches it. Rebounded by the Celtics. White dishes to Smart. Outside Tatum for the tie. Doesn't get it to drop for him. I'll tell you, this has not been his game, and he's making it worse with shot selection like that. Here's Lopez up and in on the layup. Lopez has got five now. Brooke Lopez never stopped working, especially inside where he has been a force.
a different look for Milwaukee. Portis, he's checked in for Lopez. And it's Drew Holiday in for George Hill. Celtics trail by five. White with it. He's got six. Brown kicks to Tatum. The shot's good. Brown making the play. Tatum's got 20. After hitting only one from downtown the first half, he's exploded with three cents. Passes to Connaughton. Pass to Antetokounmpo. Back to Connaughton. Green by Giannis. Connaughton passes to Portis. Tried to answer back, but that three is off the mark. Outside, smart. There's the dish to Brown. Pass to Tatum. The Celtics working the ball around now. Picked by Horford. Here's Smart. And they're unable to get the tying basket there. Here's Connaughton. Offline with his three. Well, after hitting one triple in the first half, it's been all radio silence since. White the pass to Smart. Outside Tatum. For the tie, he lays it in. Tatum's got 13 points in just this quarter. Well, off the dribble, Jason Tatum continues to perfect multiple options in his arsenal. Holiday against Smart. The pass to Giannis. Giannis is double. Moves back up, and the layup is good. Giannis has got 18 points in the game. And I really marvel at the touch of Antetokounmpo for his size and physique. That's incredible. Now here's White. He has six. And there's the bucket from Tatum. Important points there. Got him on a nice play. Getting the ball inside and right to the bucket. Passes it to Connaughton. 144 left in the third quarter of the game. And it goes down two points. Giannis has got 20. This guy is cooking right now. He is leading them on the offensive end as they remain in front here. Outside Tatum for the lead. Horford trying to free himself up. Matthews with the rebound. And so it's Matthews with it. Bringing it up now for Milwaukee. The lead is two. Portis sets the pick for Holiday. And Connaughton has it in the corner. Nailed from three-point land. He's got 14. First three of the half, second of the game. Can he heat up? Outside, smart. Pass to White. Left side, Tatum. Good D by Giannis. And they haven't been able to turn it into a big lead, but their rebounding advantage is starting to add up. And the slam dunk by Antetokounmpo. And a terrific offensive display here from Giannis, just reminding us of how dominant he can be. Tatum setting the pick for White. Tatum kicks to White. Now here's Brown. Driving the lane. And the dunk by Brown. Oh my goodness, Brown finishes off the drive, not simply laying it in, but a message of authority on the dunk. Here's Connaughton, leading by five. Now Holiday on the wing, young. Pass to Portis. And Tatum pulls it down. Tatum's got eight rebounds in this game. Brown outside. Over Matthews. And the last shot before the buzzer is off. And we've reached the end of the third. Bucks lead by five. And right after this, we'll bring you the start of the final quarter right here on 2K Sports.
and a chance right now to show you our State Farm assist of the game. Yeah, an easy choice tonight. Look at the precision on this pass. Put it on a platter for him. And when you're the beneficiary of a pass that good, you better deliver. And he did just that. Well, this has been a great contest so far, and I imagine the fourth quarter could have even more action in store for us. All right now, a chance to set the floor courtesy of Gatorade. Fourth quarter action, all fueled up and ready to go. Setting the floor for the Bucks. Holiday and Connaughton are the guard. Giannis and Portis, the lengthy post pair for him. And it's Allen in at the small forward position. Now Holiday, after the missed three from Derek White. Out of the combo, pitch to Holiday. Portis, yep, that one goes. Portis has got the fourth quarter started here with a bucket for the Bucks. Knowing it's his responsibility to find open teammates. Holiday, nice job setting the table there. And contact on the shot, so he'll be shooting free throws here. And, and I like the fact that the defense is looking to protect the rim at all costs. Now let's take a moment to get your guys' take on the scoring so far for the Bucks. Fantastic passing. We saw it in the first half, and it's carried over here in the second. Now, the other thing they've done tonight is work the ball into the paint. Plenty of their points coming from close range. And that one falls for White. Brooke Lopez is checked in for Giannis Antetokounmpo. And both free throws good for White. Bucks leading by five. Connaughton passes to Lopez. Back to Connaughton. Over to the wing. Shot clock at five. From deep three-point range, Allen's shot is off. Boston's gotten the three-point shot off 16 times tonight. Seven times they've hit it. Nine times they've missed. Over in the corner, White. Allen against Brown. Kicks it to Smart. Fires from deep. No good. Shot missing. Good D by Holiday. The Bucks shooting well. They're at 45%. to the inside. Here's Connington. He can't get that one. Now Boston takes it the other way. Brown, the pass to Smart. Last quarter of play, about two minutes in now. From outside the arc, sinks the three-pointer. Smart's got himself on the board with three there. It's great seeing Marcus Smart drain these perimeter jump shots. You know he's put in the time to let that offense become a natural part of his game. Nobody near Allen. It's good. The assist that time from Holiday. Holiday's got assist number five here tonight. The real. Come at us, and we're coming right back at you. And you would expect nothing less from these two, taking pride and making plays. Horford kicks to Brown. Horford with a screen on Allen. Here's Brown. Lopez with the block. Lopez needs to hold down the fort on defense. An incredible wingspan to get that one. The shot, no good. Now Boston takes it the other way. To the paint. Here's Williams. Drops in the layup for two. Seven points for Williams. Yeah, nothing too fancy. It, just getting the job done when they need to make every possession count. Connaughton passes to Holiday. Rebounded by the Celtics. Smart's got four rebounds in this game. Boy, 
boy, this guy just can't buy a bucket, and yet they have the advantage. Now the pass to Brown. The 11-footer. Rebounded by the Bucks. Allen's got rebound number five here tonight. Here's Connaughton. White covering. Down low. There's Allen. That's good on the assist from Lopez. Allen's got five points in the quarter. Outstanding entry pass there. He knew exactly where to go with the ball. Passes it to White. A reverse. And it's Connaughton with the rebound. Connaughton's got five rebounds tonight. And Holiday, here we go. And it's slammed in by Holiday. And how about the burst there of speed from Holiday on the drive, zipping in before the D can rotate. Smart passes to Brown. Pass to Horford. Milwaukee with the rebound. Allen inside the three-point line. It's good. The assist that time from Holiday. And it's a nine-point Bucks lead. Man, he's having quite the quarter, converting at a really high percentage. Now let's go to the sideline and catch up with our Hall of Famer, David Aldridge. Thank you, Kevin. During the last break, got to listen in on Ime Adoka's huddle with his team. I told him this is gut check time. This is when it gets real and when it gets fun. We're here to play in these big moments. Let's make this one count. Kevin, by my count, that's five cliches. All right, David, thanks. Celtics trail by nine. Brown outside. Over in the corner, White. The shot's good. Brown making the play. Brown's got three assists in the game. I think Brown demonstrating he's got a great understanding of the game. He keeps his head moving, his eyes open, so he can spot the open man. Here's Allen. That one falls through. It's his sixth make from the four this game. Now six for ten. Efficiency has been the hallmark right now down the stretch. He is making the most of his opportunities. Horford with a screen on Holiday. Pass to Brown. Lock at six. And he makes good on the layup. Boy, what a score right there. Jalen Brown able to absorb the hit, still make the shot. This guy is a big time talent. Now here is Holiday. Portis in the post, working on Williams. Boston's gotten off four three-pointers in the final quarter, and two of them have fallen. Smart passes to Brown. There's the pass to Horford. Over Lopez. Horford, no luck. 
the defense would a really good job of choking off the middle there once he got inside. Allen passes to Portis. Another shot. And another shot. And that's two points on the layup. Portis has got four this quarter. Well, just it's easy to say this guy wanted it more. Creating the second chance opportunity and cashing in. White dishes to Smart. Here's Brown. Good and Smart gets the assist. Smart's got nine assists now tonight. Well, this is where the powerful frame and explosive athleticism of Jalen Brown becomes a problem for the opponent. Nicely done. Outside Holiday. Back to Connaughton. High post Lopez. There's Portis. That three off target had some space there after the little pump fake. Horford against Lopez. Horford kicks to Brown. Over Allen. And it's Brown missing. Bucks leading by six. Here's Connaughton on the wing. Holiday. And Lopez has it in the corner. Back to Holiday. A three ball. Horford with the rebound. Horford's got rebound number eight here tonight in the game. Right the pass to Smart. Back to White. Passes it to Brock. From the arc. Rebounded by the Bucks. Portis has got 11 rebounds in the game. And, and they continue to control the glass. And giving up some inches inside, but makes up for it with an aggressive style. Well, he's attacking, he's forcing the issue, and that's simply stated a terrific play. Tatum, he's checked in for Boston. Milwaukee also making some changes. Giannis Antetokounmpo is checked in for Portis. And Wesley Matthews subbed in for Pat Connington. And here's Holiday. And no good that time. So the Celtics will take it the other way. Lopez against Smart. Outside Tatum. The kick out to Brown. Four on the clock. Three pointer. Ante Takumbo pulls it in. Ante Takumbo's got rebound number 13 for him here tonight. Allen finds Lopez. And Lopez throws it down. 
Boy, you love Lopez's effort. This guy dunking is easy for him, right? He's close to the rim, seven foot. Come on now. And it's Brooke Lopez with the foul. That is his first foul of the game. How about that strong defensive performance for this half's mobile one block? And this is postseason play at its finest, refusing to give up shots here in the playoffs. Allen against Tatum. Horford with a screen on Allen. Tatum passes to Horford. And a kind roll that time off the rim as that one falls. Al Horford's shot is just so pretty. Doesn't get a ton of lift, but boy, is he accurate. Pass to Antetokounmpo. Inside, here's Lopez, and the dunk by Lopez. And he placed that pass out in front of him and let him just run into it in rhythm. Tatum drives in. And the rejection by Giannis. Latrey. Rebound, Boston. Brown's got his seventh rebound here tonight. Tatum against Holiday. Tatum dishes to Horford. The Celtics working the ball around now. And the shot is good. The Bucs lead has been cut down now to just three on the bucket from Tatum. You have to be willing to shoulder the offensive burden. I think Jason Tatum is built for it. And to the Kumbo finds Holiday. Back to Giannis. The shot, no good. Excellent D there from Williams. Tatum passes to Horford. Tatum trying to break free. Horford gets the bucket. Well, this guy's such a polished player from this area of the floor. Al Horford, it doesn't get any easier than that one right there. Lopez a screen. Pass to Andacumbo. Back to Holiday. Giannis sets a screen for Holiday. Over Williams. Al Horford with the rebound. And, and he has definitely been struggling in this quarter. And you know what? They keep calling his number, and they're simply trying to get him out of this funk. Now, here's Tatum. Horford with a screen on Allen. Tatum drives in. Yes! And that one sends the bench into a frenzy. I'll tell you, these guys have worked so hard together. Everyone pulling in the same direction. Beautiful to watch. Andre Dekumbo looking over the floor. 
And how about that? What a sensational finish. Yeah, you you got to be able to get some hang time to do that one. So it's Boston now. They trail by one. Tatum drives in. And now they decide to foul intentionally. And so Allen will bring it up for Milwaukee. And now we've got the intentional foul. He hits the first one, and that will put them up by two. And a multiple-time winner of the MVP award, the next step for Giannis is to become a consistent shooter from the outside. So he gets them both, and it's a three-point game. Well, it doesn't get much bigger than that. A perfect trip to the line to give them the critical three-point cushion. What poise.
23 seconds left here in the fourth quarter. Outside Tatum. Smart on the wing. Outside Williams. Launches a three. Misses the three. And they foul intentionally. That's what they have to do at this point. Yeah, you, you have to do that, though. You can't just let them dribble the game. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. It's the first, and that gives them a four-point cushion. It definitely has the respect of the locker room. Holiday is someone that players enjoy playing with. And so he drops them both. It's a five-point game. Well, this trip to the line should seal the deal. Amazing job. And so the Bucks take the win. This was a pivotal game in the series so far, and they were able to keep their heads great, get the job done, and take the all-important three games to two lead. Now they can breathe yeah, right. just a little bit easier oh, knowing goodness. they're just one win away from closing this thing out. Had they lost this game, the pressure on them would have been huge. Oh, just gigantic. You're right. And we've got David Aldridge standing by on our sideline with the player of the game. David, it's all yours. Thanks very much, Giannis. Great individual performance. I guess you're going for another MVP, huh? Hey, you know, I try not to think about it that much. Uh, my mind says do my job, do whatever it takes to help my team win, and uh, all I get about is I've got to win. Love the humble brag, man. Congrats on the win. Thanks. All right, David, thank you. That'll do it for this broadcast of the NBA Eastern Conference Semifinals. For Greg Anthony, Doris Burke, and David Aldridge, this is Kevin Harlan along with our terrific 2K Sports crew thanking you for tuning in. As we leave you with our New Balance player of the game, Giannis Antetokounmpo.